What's in the box? Let's get straight into it. I'm not going to say what this video is about. Everyone does it. You obviously Googled it. So I don't need to be thinking that there's idiots out there and have to explain it again. You're a lot more intelligent than that. Anyway, look at this. Oof. Do you know what? For the money, this looks pretty good. You know what? That's really, really nice. Really nice. It's got a shrink wrap film on it, obviously to protect it. Inside here, this is where the lock... I'm going to see if there's any bulbs in it, because obviously being clear, you need to have the respective bulbs now, like a red and an amber, for the break and the indicator. Well, look, there they are. All good. So I don't need to buy bulbs. I thought I might need to purchase those separately but not push that back on yeah. little clip there very good right let's get it on the car and see what it looks like let water in over the years and even though there's nothing wrong with this it's looking a bit tired so let's get that off let's get the new one on okay so okay so there's two four mil bolts they look like this now with these two removed you need to pull the unit this way towards the back and if you look at the new one you can see that there's these little clips here these little ball sockets which will push on like that so I've got a little nylon plastic tool here to help lever this off and there's the old unit the lights have just come off Okay, so here we go, looking nice, looking sharp, nice and new, gives it a fresh look and there's the old one there as a comparison, really does make the, the car just look that much fresher, well worth it for the money, excellent, perfect fit as well, plug and play, two screws, job done. Give you an idea of all the lights and what they look like, brake light indicator obviously and that's just the normal lights comparison to what's going on on the other side that was the original so uh, very happy looks really good almost like an LED light that spot on there we go all done all in all it took me about 10 minutes gives a nice clean fresh look and I tell you what for aftermarket lights you can't really grumble at the price they cost me about a hundred and thirty pounds it cost me more than that just for the actual clear plastic lens and that's why I thought well I'm just gonna buy these instead it's an old car doesn't cost me anything so I don't want to spend a fortune on it but uh, I think that looks spot on